this is my insanely messy bedroom. <sighs> so <laughs> I keep telling people like I'm the tidiest girl in this world, <laughs> but it's a lie. That's a huge lie. I'm so messy. I'm sorry, future husband. So this is like episode zero. Yeah, this is gonna be episode zero. These are the things, the essentials I'm going to bring with me. This is a shiwi. I'll talk about this later. So I'm gonna start just vlogging to uh, like document my life when I move to Thailand. It's because uh, I feel Actually, I feel quite bad that I'm uh, up and leaving uh, so soon. Like, I got, you know, I got family, I got nieces and nephews, which I already miss terribly. So the reason why I'm making this is so that they can uh, feel like they're part of my journey, maybe. was supposed to be day number one but I'm not ready to start yet oh it's noon and I'm about to have my second nap already Watching community for the second time, eating some delicious homemade chocolate cake, just waiting for the night to roll in so you can go to work the next day. Oh, that's how I live my life. It's chill, you know? Very comfortable. But my life isn't gonna be like this from next week. From next week, I can't, um, I can't just chill in my comfortable bed, open the window and feel the five degree breath of cold air coming into my room, the familiar um, ocean smell and the sound of my mother's telling me in the living room. It's so surreal to think about that I'm actually moving to Thailand, that little me is going to live in the middle of the jungle I'm gonna be in a land where the heat might actually kill me <sighs> the food culture is also quite different teaching English to small children <laughs> should I just saw cats to teach in Asia has always like been my been my dream ever since I was like a wee child, ever since I learned how to spell Asia. It's scary to think about what if it isn't the what? What I dreamed about. To be honest, I'm not sure if I I'm not sure if I what I've actually dreamed it to be. Just something different from my life I guess. Exhausting exotic. Exotic. And exciting but what if it sucks what if I end up having a terrible time I do think that is up to me though I can choose to have a bad time I can choose to have a good time it depends on how I look at it and I want to look at it as a great adventure I want to learn about the culture I want to learn to handle spicy food I'm gonna learn another language and hopefully I'll learn more about myself and grow as a person and I do hope that I'll be able to bring as much into their life as they're going to bring into mine. I'm not sure, I'm not sure at all what I've actually signed up for but I do hope every one of you will join me on my journey in this faraway country. 
I'll show you happy times and maybe I'll show you sad times but uh, before I start my journey uh, I want to show you guys a, uh, a tribute uh, from my country to know who you are today you need to look back on where you have been but I was made and I was made with the legends and trolls and fairy tale creatures were born Så fang og dropper ut 